hydrogen is the ultimate sustainable eco-friendly energy source of the future. Part 5 of Fuel Cell Electric Vehicles. So how will hydrogen energy transform our world? Globally, progress is being made to improve hydrogen production technology and to build needed infrastructure. In Australia, a solar power plant has been built in the vast Pilbara Desert, an area of 500,000 square kilometers, in order to produce hydrogen with 100% clean energy. The solar power plant generates electricity to decompose water creating hydrogen, which is then converted to ammonia or liquid hydrogen to make it easier to transport. Transportation technology to export it to the entire world is also being researched. The Chinese government is also pursuing ambitious hydrogen policies to realize its visions for the hydrogen industry. According to the plan released by the Chinese Ministry of Industry and Information, China is planning to have 500,000 fuel cell electric vehicles by 2025 and over a million by 2030. Moreover, they are developing their fuel cell electric vehicle industry by focusing on large vehicles such as buses and trucks. Additionally, Europe's largest oil refinery company has begun building a water electrolysis-based hydrogen production plant, while France has decided to build a large eco-friendly hydrogen production plant that does not emit carbon dioxide. At present, the use of fossil fuels is leading to the emission of massive amounts of greenhouse gases as well as various sulfur oxides. However, if the energy we use in industries is transitioned to hydrogen, we will get closer to resolving environmental issues. Demand for hydrogen will rapidly increase from 8 EJ in 2015 to 78 EJ by 2050, amounting to 18% of the entire demand for energy. The outlook is also bright in the power plant sector. Going forward, it is forecast that hydrogen energy will account for more than 10% of electricity and heat used in homes and industries around the world. The effect this will have on the environment will be priceless. Most of the energy consumed in buildings is natural gases or electricity. In the case of heating, the dependency on fossil fuels accounts for more than half. If we transition to hydrogen fuel cells, we will be able to supply highly efficient heating energy and electricity at the same time. In the future, if hydrogen prices fall, it will be an economic source of energy for buildings. Next generation modes of transportation, such as unmanned aerial vehicles and drones, also will use hydrogen energy. Hydrogen drones are expected to be utilized in various industries, including government agencies and the military. In January 2019, a drone succeeded in flying for 10 hours on liquid hydrogen. Demand for hydrogen energy is expected to be especially high in the transport sector. As hydrogen infrastructure, construction and market size grows, the mobility industry, including cars, trains, ships and drones, is expected to use hydrogen. By 2050, the transport sector is expected to use 28% of all hydrogen energy. Fuel cell electric vehicles will expand to account for 20 to 25% of all vehicles. In the foreseeable future, electric passenger cars will be used to drive short distances. While larger vehicles, trains and ships will use fuel cell electric technology to travel longer distances. From trains, ships, airplanes, to houses and buildings. Hydrogen will be used extensively as an energy source. The age of hydrogen economy has begun.